work out the size of each angle marked with a letter okay let us see, check the first figure given see here this is the angle which we have to find out we have a triangle and the baseline is actually extended like this and so we can use the exterior angle theorem right this is the exterior angle of this triangle which will be equal to the sum of the opposite internal angles these two are the opposite internal angles for this exterior angle so here we can write y is equal to 68 plus 35 that much degrees we will get so we will get it as 103 degrees next let us do the next part b part of the question here this is the angle which we have to find out here for this triangle this line this x z side is extended so this is an exterior angle here also we can use the same theorem exterior angle is same as the sum of opposite interior angles so here in that question y will be equal to 81 plus 67 degrees okay when we add you will get it as 148 degrees 148 okay then the third c part here which all things are given okay a triangle and the baseline is again extended like this see these two sides are equal that is the meaning of the symbol these two sides are equal and so we know this is an isosceles triangle and in an isosceles triangle these two angles are equal right because these two angles are opposite to equal sides so these two angles are equal and here what we have to find out is again the exterior angle over here which will be sum, the sum of this 42 and this angle so this angle is unknown no let us name name it as x okay now in order to get the value of x let us use angle sum property of the triangle angle sum means angles of a triangle when added we should get 180 degree so 42 degree plus x plus x plus x plus x we need 180 degree so x plus x 2x so 2x is equal to when this 42 goes to the next side it become subtraction because the 42's operation over here is addition when it comes to the next side it become subtraction so we'll get it as 138 and 2x is equal to 138 okay and so x is equal to when this 2 is taken to the next side here 2's operation is multiplication when it moves to the next side it become division so 138 divided by 2 so we will get it as 69 degrees thus we got x as 69 degrees right we got the value of x now actually without using the exterior angle property we can find out the value of y because this x this 69 degree is linear pair of y right so linear pair we know the angles when we add we should get 180 degree so there are 69 plus y right see 69 plus y we should get 180 degrees so y will be 180 minus 69 right so you will get it as 111 so the value of y is 111 degrees hope all of you understood thank you